You're watching the History Channel. Hey man, uh, can I have a hamburger, fries, and a Coke? Would you like cheese on your hamburger? Uh, no, but that's an amazing costume. Exactly what are you referring to? Well, you know, you get the wacky clothes and the, the, the crown. Did you, did you get that for being employee of the month? I'll have you know I earned this crown by beheading my own mother. What? It was a joke. Yes, he looks like an actual king, but he's really a modern-day high school student who's trying to earn some extra spending money by working here as the mascot. Remember? <laughs> But a secret. I'm going out for a smoke. I need one of you two to do food prep. I'll do it. A woman allowed to use knives? That's hilarious. <laughs> Henry, women can do anything men can do. Remember? Yeah, well, they still can't write their name in snow with their own pee. <laughs> 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 Unless, of course, you are referring to Catherine of Prussia, who, like many in her family, was an hermaphrodite. In medieval Europe, noble families were often comprised of cousins marrying cousins. Inbreeding on such a large scale produced a myriad of birth defects, including hermaphrodites, human beings who had both a penis and a vagina. Wow, that's a lot of chicken. <sighs> yeah, it is. And when I come back from my smoke, it better all be chopped, Henry, or your ass is grass. <laughs> oh, and by the way, I tried to process your paperwork, and for some reason it wouldn't go through, so can't pay you. Sorry about that, bro. Yeah, well, sorry about this, bro. <laughs> You know what, dude? You're on probation. You know what, dude? You're on amputation. <laughs> you know what, Henry? Forget probation. You're fired. Oh. Oh. Henry! Uh, you just killed our weekend part-time assistant manager right before a lunch hour. What are we going to do with the body? Mm. Mm. <laughs> By the way, what's in the special sauce? If I told you, I'd have to kill you. If... <laughs> <laughs>